Welcome everyone to my channel that is fast and easy maths which is dedicated to give you tips and tricks related to mathematics. So students today we are going to understand a brilliant trick to do squares of mixed fractions. As you can see I am going to teach you all how to find squares of these numbers in matter of seconds. In fact you can do this orally. You won't believe it is so simple and also towards the end of the video i will show you the logic behind it why does that work or i'll give you the proper explanation that how does this trick work okay so let's begin the first thing first what you should do is you should multiply the integer part with the number which is coming next to it so the number which is coming after five is what six so you are going to multiply five and six so your answer is going to be 30 0.25 okay or you can also write this answer if you want it, it, it to be represented in the form of a fraction you can write this as nothing but 31 by 4 okay I hope you got it right so now students if you like the way I'm explaining then please go ahead and hit the like button because that gives me tremendous amount of encouragement in doing these kind of videos also students don't forget to give a subscribe to my channel so that whenever I push up a video you will be able to you will be notified with such tricks okay so the next thing okay all the answers I'm going to write down in terms of fractions as well as in terms of decimals okay so this one now what is the number which comes after 10 is what 11 so this is very simple multiplying 11 with 10 you get what 1 1 0 and if you want it to be written in terms of decimal it will be 0 0.25 or you can also write this as nothing but 1 1 0 1 by 4 okay so I hope you are getting the whole logic behind this particular trick or you you are able to understand the trick okay so I would like to take I would like to tell all of you all to take a pause and try solving the rest of the questions okay and then after uh, you know after you have finished solving you can skip through and see what is my answer or match your answer basically so very quickly this will be 7 into 8 that will be what 56.25 so the answer is 56 1 by 4 Similarly, for this one, which would be 9 into 10, so that would be 90.25 or you can say 91 by 4, correct? So, this one will be what? 6 into 7, that is what? 42.25 or it would be 421 by 4. Now, please understand, I'm now this is, we are coming to the part of explanation. How is this trick working, okay? Uh, students before I before me starting with the explanation I want to tell you all that at the end of the video I'm going to put up a DIY question whose answer you can mention in the comment section okay but you have to use the trick which I have shown okay obviously after learning this trick I'm telling you you will never use the traditional method of 9 1 by 2 first converted into um, say, uh, improper form that is what 19 upon two then take the fraction and uh, sorry take the square and all of that you will not do okay so now over here the trick explanation see understand if you remember in many of my videos i've already told about this trick any number any number which ends in five let's say 15 if you want to take square of it it's very simple your last two digits of the answer will be 25 because that will be square of 5 and the first digit or the first two digits or whatever the first part of your answer will be nothing but 1 multiplied by the number coming after it so 1 into 2 that is 2 so the answer for 15 square is 225 similarly if you want to try for 35 this we can do it quickly 3 into 4 which will get you 12 and then the next part is 25 if you have any doubts you can go ahead and check your answers with the calci okay so now I have used the simple same trick over here but in form of mixed form so now over here let's talk about 10 10 and a half this is nothing but what 10 plus 1 by 2 right and if you write it in terms of decimal I can write this as 10 plus 0 0.5 1 by 2 1 by 2 is nothing but 0 0.5 so when you add them you get 10.5 okay the whole square 
now this number itself is getting ending or oh sorry is is ended in 5 okay so your also your first part will be 25 after that there will be a decimal point because there is a decimal point after 5 okay and the next is same logic you just multiply 10 with the number which is coming after it that is 11 so 10 into 11 is 110.25 so that is your answer if you look over here for this one is your answer the same answer is matching now you might be wondering acha 0.25 then how did i find this See, it's very simple just as 1 by 2 is 0 0.5 we know that 1 by 4 is what 0 0.25 okay so here if i want to write this in form of a mixed fraction i can write this as nothing but 110 plus 0 0.25 right and this 0 0.25 can be written as 110 1 by 4 okay so i hope you have got the trick okay i really really wish that if you have any other doubts or if you are finding some other topic of mathematics which is very difficult please mention so in the comment section i will definitely try to make a video on the same so now time for your diy i want you to tell me what will be the square of uh, let's say 4 1 by 2 do let me know your answers in the comment section so that's it for today i will see you in the next video